Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do on each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for February 8th of 2022. Well, it is titled Aurora and light pillars over Norway. So what do we see here? Well, in the foreground, we see a person kind of pointing at two sides of the sky and seeing two different atmospheric effects. On the left hand side, we see the green glow of the aurora. Now the aurora are caused when charged particles from the sun strike the Earth's magnetic field and are funneled around it towards the poles. And that's where they strike Earth's atmosphere when the magnetic field lines come into the atmosphere and they excite the atoms there. And the green glow is caused by the excitation of oxygen atoms in Earth's upper atmosphere. And when they glow, they give off a distinct green color. And you can get an idea of the intensity of the aurora by seeing how it lights up the ground around it. And you can see that green glow all over covering the snow and uh, plants in the area. Now we also can see that the aurora is not a cloud. It is not something that blocks out light because we can see stars right through it. So even the uh, fainter in the fainter areas, we can actually see stars that where their light passes through it. That's because it's just a glowing of the atmosphere. So it does brighten the atmosphere and make it harder to see things. However, you can still see through it because it is not actually a cloud, even though they might resemble clouds in some ways. Now on the other side, we see uh, light pillars, the pillars stretching up into the sky uh, with the lights from the distant city there. And this is uh, caused by ice crystals. In fact, many millions of ice crystals within the atmosphere. And as they fall, they can create pillars of light. So as they stretch up uh, into the sky, they give great pillars from light down below. So light down below is then pulled or bent upwards through these light pillars, giving us the really nice effect that we get for today, two different effects within the sky. So as those ice crystals fall kind of flat to the ground, those then bring those colors and you can see the different coloring. And that is caused by the different colors of the lights on the ground. It is really just bringing that light, pulling it into that uh, pillar uh, because of the ice crystals. So as that moves, as that goes up there, we see that on one side and we see the aurora on the other side. And we do see the photographer in the foreground kind of saying, which one do you like better? And you can click on which is your favorite uh, on the regular on the website, which is linked to in the description as to whether you prefer the left half of the Aurora or the right half in the light pillars. So here we get to see both of them today in one nice image taken in Norway. So that was our picture of the day for February 8th of 2022. It was titled Aurora and Light Pillars over Norway. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be to circle a dying star. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.